what lives in tide pools invertebrates the most common kinds of animals in the in tide pools are called invertebrates these animals have soft bodies and no backbones they range from creatures such as sponges and corals to creatures such as uh, octopi and sea stars. Invertebrates also include animals such as animals, jellyfish, worms, crabs, shrimp, snails, and urchins. Invertebrate can be stationary or mobile. These drawings show invertebrates commonly found in tide pools. Fish. Another group of animals commonly found in tide pools is fish. Which do have vapor. There are many types of fish that are adapted to life in the tide pools. Since tide pools are small compared to the ocean, fish that live in them are usually small. Other fish accidentally get trapped in tide pools when the tide goes up. These fish are not used to living in such a small space. They wait until the tide returns to swim off in the, in the open sea. <laughs> land animals. Many land animals also visit tide pools. The shallow water in tide pools makes it easy for these animals to find that it feed quicker. Many birds, including seagulls and ravens, eat oysters, mussels, and eat fish. Ma mammals such as raccoons and monkeys can scoop up animals and eat them. Plant like array organisms. There are also many plant like organisms in tide pools. Most of these belong to a group called marine algae. They are also known as seaweed. There are many uh, there are many different types of seaweed, but only some of them are found in tide pools. Seaweed provides good hiding places for animals. It also provides a substrate to which some animals attach themselves to their eggs. Exploring tide pools. Tide pools are fun to explore. They are like an aquarium full of sea creatures. If you ever go to the ocean, find a place where there, there are tide pools. The best places to find tide pools are rocky shores. Pay attention to the rising air. Following the of the tides, usually newspapers here, the ocean publish the times and heights of the tides. Remember the lower uh, the tide, the more you are likely to see. When you find the tide pool to explore, there are some things you can do to. To help you see more creatures, it's the best to, to move slowly and gently to avoid stepping and 
on or crushing animals. Sometimes it is good idea to jump just to stop and closely observe one small area that you can then you find interesting. The longer you look, the more likely you are to see things. Remember that the tide pool is home to many creatures. If you lift up a rock to look for creatures, do so gently. <coughs> Always put rocks black where you found them. Check with another if you want to pick up a tide pool animals. Uh, some of them can sting. Put some water in your hand first to keep the animal moist. And always put sea creatures back where you found them. Animals need to stay in their tight poor homes. They don't make good pets and li are likely to die if they are removed from the tide pool mm. 2011 May 30 uh, 1st Today is the last of last day of May. Uh, I went to school. We had a lesson for the internet for the people that use the internet so much. So we went to gym, gym, or or grades. Uh, were there. So we sit in there and listen to the lesson for two hours. So we must be not good. Uh, there's nobody that can sit only uh anyway just sit good two hours cause of that the teachers punished us very long time so we went to have lunch so late later than normally so we couldn't play soccer so much so every body didn't like that teacher i think so too the teacher wants perfect there's nobody that someone can sit perfectly or uh, two hours and do nothing just listening and looking at the teacher the teacher wanted us to uh, sit and um, make straight our backbones and uh, raise our face and my our hands must be uh, on our dance to make and never move and never speak anything. That's impossible. Mm. So after mm, after school, I played soccer with friends. Because I don't go to Mass Academy today, and after playing soccer, I went to academy, English Academy, and I came back to home, and I did homework.